Grace and peace to you with our Lord Jesus Christ. Today is Sunday. Okay. For me, it's believe him who he sent, pray ceaselessly, shine your good works among men that they will know it's rotten God, repent, spread the gospel. And in honor of Sundays, I'm going to list the commandments of God, which are basically do nots. So we have remember the Sabbath and keep it holy. Honor thy father and thy mother do not bear false testimony. Do not kill. Do not steal. Do not covet. Do not commit adultery. And don't take the Lord's name in vain. So, I'm going to go ahead and try to name five more commandments of Jesus. So we've got give to the needy, heal the sick, raise the dead, fast, love the Lord thy God with all your strength, all your soul, all your mind all your heart so I've got seven I'm going to start recording these videos before I go out into public because it is harder to get the message out there. Wow, there's so many things going on. So I'll play this video out in public while I'm praying. I'm going to go ahead and try to name those two more. I had eight. Go and learn what this means. I desire mercy.
and take my yoke upon you. Lay up treasures in heaven. And rejoice. So, it's November 25th, 2018. And I'm going to go to Kingdom Hall today. If I'm lucky enough, church at the Brevard Wesleyan Church starts at 1115. So the Kingdom Hall with the Jehovah Witnesses are at 10 o'clock and I'm getting picked up at 930 if that works out. Another commandment of Jesus is that we don't make promises. I mean, they all just keep coming, and I've reloaded it so many times. I'm actually going to research iniquity, and for that it brought me to uh, finding where Moses talked about Jesus Christ. It's in John 4 that it says to do that, saying that they had never even heard the voice of God. So as I'm storing up all these commandments, I find them that they have fallen away, and I have to reload them. So now I'm going to follow my Lord, our Lord. So I just, I pray grace and peace to all the world with Jesus Christ. And I ask that my testimony be correct, 